Hi, this is Erin Harrison coming to you from IT Expo in Austin, Texas. And I'm joined today by Todd Carruthers, who's the Executive Vice President of Sales and Marketing for Counterpath. Welcome, Todd. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks for being here. Um, so tell us about Counterpath and what you guys do. So Counterpath is just over 10 years old, and we develop uh, soft phones, uh, convergence servers so uh, to, uh, for convergence applications, as well as um, provisioning servers to configure soft phones in the field. Okay, we were talking earlier a little bit about the uh, bring your own device phenomenon. Yeah. Where do you guys fit into that? Well, so what we're finding is we're getting a huge pull from our enterprise uh, customers because they're having a, a problem right now trying to handle devices that are coming into their environments uh, outside of their control and be trying to, and trying to give them uh, uniform services for, for uh, voice-based uh, services across VoIP clients that we sell. So we sell clients across mobile devices, tablets, and desktop. So what we do is we help them um, by providing our provisioning server with our actual uh, soft phones so that all they have to do, the users have to do is enter a username and password. It, it goes directly right into the enterprise infrastructure and all the settings for that, for that particular PBX, for example, are pushed down to those clients. What are some of the challenges that you see enterprises having to, to deal with in terms of bring your own device? So some of them is, is just controlling the, the, the number of devices that hit their network, uh, the number of, of changes that happen from the OS um, uh, updates that happen from Android or even iOS. And so what we do is we kind of manage that for them by providing the updates for the applications and provide them right on iTunes and Android Store. And they can actually control that through our provisioning server and push it down to the clients and give them reminders to their, to their customers, which are users within their enterprise, mm -hmm. to update those clients to make sure that it's working. So the most important thing for them is not to get the support calls, so we help alleviate that by making sure everything's always updated and, and provisioned down to the end users. And how do you really differentiate yourselves from your competitors out there? So for Counterpath, what we do is we have um, the, the largest set of clients across the different domains. So whether that be desktop, uh, Windows, Mac, uh, Linux, uh, mobiles, Android, iOS, or tablets, Android, iOS. Uh, we support all those different OSs and the different devices that, that are there. So the whole fragmentation, there's over, actually there's over 6,000 devices if you count them all, not just phones, but Android devices out there. Um, so that becomes a headache for, for enterprises to, to really handle. So we, we do all the work of certifying against those devices, so to make sure that you know, our products will work on all those devices before they deploy them. Um, so that's a big di differentiator for us against our competitors because we're just the size of us mm -hmm. compared to our competitors that just don't have that kind of uh, resource available. The other area that we, we always um, uh, we're differentiated against is certainly the, the custom, customization that we can do against those clients. So a lot of customers will have specific features, even enterprise customers, that are very unique from other customers. So we can develop our client in a way to, to meet those uh, very specific um, uh, requirements and do it across the board for not just one customer, but for everyone. So that's something that's very significant uh, from a differentiation standpoint. And probably the last one is, is the brandability, to be able to brand and put graphical assets so it makes it look like their phone uh, on the desktop um, and put their graphical assets on it as well. Okay, we were also talking earlier about the uh, video trend. Um, so how do you see video as, as also being a part of enterprise deployments? So video is absolutely huge. Uh, we see about 40% video uptake in enterprise. And uh, what's really happening with our client, we have, you know, our client supports voice, video, instant messaging, presence, and even SMS in some deployments. So what we're seeing in the enterprise is we see a lot of um, spontaneous um, communications. So what that means, as an example, is, uh, is a user might uh, see something, let's say, on, on, a, on a line in a, in a uh, manufacturing facility, and they may want to IM someone in their organization. They'll go ahead and IM them, and then they can go from that IM to a voice call, and then they can do a video call and show them exactly what they're seeing on the spot. So video has become this huge application within voice, within IM and presence, and kind of melding around that. And so we see that just growing up in a huge way. Okay, and what's been happening since we last talked to you guys in San Jose? So since we last spoke, um, we've updated our products across the board. We've added um, Android tablet uh, to, to the mix and also the iOS tablet to the mix. Um, we've updated the iPhone and Android products to support, um, across all our product lines, voice, video, and IMR presence, as I mentioned earlier. And we've added that provisioning server that I touched on uh, earlier in our conversation, where um, it really helps you know, our customers deploy the products in a very seamless and easy manner. Okay, and what's next for the company? So looking forward, you're going to see a lot of new features come around collaboration, 
unified communication, social networking integration, especially for the small, medium-sized businesses and how that impacts their business. Mm -hmm. um, uh, all those type of technologies will be at the, you know, the forefront of a counterpath's um, client technology and we'll mix those together so clients, customers only have to use one product to, to, to access all those different services. Okay, great. Thanks, Todd. Thank you.